John Sale is a former assistant special Watergate prosecutor and special, former special assistant to the attorney general. John, appreciate your time this morning. So it, often we had to remind ourselves and others through this process what this investigation initially set out to do. What is the scope or was the scope of this investigation? Well, the scope originally was to look into whether or not there was a f interference in the two 2016 election by the Russians, and if so, if the Trump campaign was involved in that. But that investigation's over, and I think round one, the president should be very happy. But it's only round one, and now we're, where are we? We're waiting for the attorney general to decide what his summary is going to be. What he received from Mueller is, by regulation, confidential. Uh, so now, what is he going to release? And I think what he's going to release sometime today may disappoint us because I don't think it's going to be as detailed or give the underlying information that everybody's waiting for. When you say disappoint the, us, the, what do you mean? Well, the buzzword is transparency. I mean, everybody wants transparency. But interestingly enough, the attorney general is conferring yesterday and today with the deputy, Rod Rosenstein. And guess what he said about transparency? He said, it's a knee-jerk reaction to think that's a good thing, that there are times when we should not be transparent, and he was referring to this situation. So uh, I'll tell you what I think. I watched Attorney General Barr in his confirmation hearing, and I was so impressed that I wrote an article that was published in The Hill, which was called, I'm looking at it, William Barr is the right man for the times. And I'll tell you why. I think he's going to not be influenced by Congress, by demonstrations, I think he's going to follow the law. And I think the law is going to limit some types mm -hmm. of information that we'd all like to see. Well, and, and he uh, has already said that he's also seeking Robert Mueller's uh, counsel on what exactly can be released and made transparent under the constraints of the law. Uh, so we'll see. We're in the wait and see. I, I, hear, I heard you say this is round one. What's round two? Well, round two will, will be, first of all, the, what they do in Congress. If they, the, uh, Democrats, Republicans all said, we're waiting for the Mueller report, we're waiting for the Mueller report, like that would be gospel. Well, now what they're really saying is, depends upon what the Mueller report says. So they're not necessarily going to accept it. But there's going to be a big battle over the things that Attorney General Barr will not allow released. And uh, well, there's one thing, when they're saying that they shouldn't give the White House a, quote, sneak peek. Uh, it's not a sneak peek. I'm ordered, they, they're not going to destroy it. They're not going to rip it up. Uh, they are entitled to preview it, the Je White House counsel, because executive privilege is real. It's not something to hide behind. Mm -hmm. It's real, and only the president can determine whether or not to assert it. Mm -hmm. Nobody else can. And if Final he does question assert to you, John, it, 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 is when you started out, you, you, you talked about the scope of the investigation and how it originally right. began. Did the scope of the investigation change? Well, I think the only way it changed with Mueller was with the Manafort case in Virginia, which he had permission from Rosenstein to do it, but it didn't have anything to do with the president, didn't have anything to do with collusion. But I think he's done. What I'm really saying is, all these other investigations the president still has to deal with. But public opinion matters greatly. I learned that from Watergate. And that's why these polls are important. And as long as the president has the support of the public, I think ultimately he's going to prevail. Makes it all very interesting. John Sale, great insight there. Thank you.